When a set injects into the naturals, it has countability. When a group has exactly two normal subgroups, it has simplicity. Complex differentiability is holomorphicity. Equal upper and lower sums implies integrability. The number of repeated roots is the algebraic multiplicity. The eigenspace dimension is the geometric multiplicity. When both are equal, we have diagonalizability. The Grand-Schmidt process outputs vectors with orthogonality. Hey, welcome to Trinity, a place full of vivacity, where mathmos hustle in unity until they lose their sanity. Although we have an affinity, for maths we're quite the oddity, cause we're a wild variety, don't be fooled by our sobriety. As mathmos, being crystal clear is a necessity. Cause 99% of us can't write proofs, what a tragedy. So how exactly does one go about judging a proof's quality? Well no one should tell you, you should just know that it's true in its entirety. A positive recurrent Markov chain with aperiodicity and irreducibility has ergodicity. Such chains approach a unique point of stationarity. Almost surely, in other words, with unit probability. Dette minus lambda i tells us the algebraic multiplicity. The number of Jordan blocks is the geometric multiplicity. The inner product is a function with bilinearity. And when it vanishes, we have orthogonality.